everybody and today we are unboxing this brand new special edition Travelers Company and the Superior Labor Collaboration Travelers Notebook. Now I did opt to get the blue version of this. There is a camel version as well and my dear friend Mitz from My Life Mitz helped me procure this um, because it's over in Japan and um, we work together for the stationery selection. She's the owner and I'm one of the design team members. So she just sent it over with my November box. So I just got it in and I'm super excited. Let's go ahead and jump in. So here are the pretty papers that come with the packaging. This gives you an idea of what comes inside the package. And this is just the informational little paper sleeve. Um, I always save these and I'm really excited about this. It is always such a treasure to get one of these new notebooks and I always save all of the elastics that come with it. Um, there comes a red one in this particular edition and then another blue spare elastic and I always save those. Oh my gosh, look at this. Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. Oh, the smell. <laughs> The smell is unbeatable. You guys know if you have anything from the Traveler's Company, you know the smell I'm talking about. It is absolutely unbeatable. And this blue is really, really nice. This feels like a nice, I don't know, it feels like a nice um, medium between the original Pan Am blue that came out and then the re release of um, the blue that they have added to their regular line. Um, it's soft um, and a little bit shiny like the Pan Am blue and it's really really soft and not very pebbly on the inside. But the thing that I love obviously is this beautiful um, printed image on the front. I can't tell if it's silver or just white. It's just so beautiful. I mean, it is just really hard to tell. I tried to look up really close. Um, and even in person, it's really difficult to tell. I want to say it is silver foiled, but it is not shiny. Um, there is very little glean to it. It just looks like a really, really bright, vibrant white color, but I do believe it is maybe a matte silver foil, but it is beautiful none nonetheless. Um, like I said, there was a camel version of this as well. And rather than the printed image that you see here in the camel version, it is um, sort of debossed into it. It's sort of pressed into the leather and it's really, really pretty. I really did like that a lot, but Mitz was only allowed to get one of each and she preferred the camel. I didn't have a preference. Um, I do have... A love of the blue notebooks because my very first one was the Pan Am blue so I do have um, a little bit of a preference there um, but this is just absolutely beautiful um, the elastic that comes with it is this lighter blue so you do get three different color elastics which I don't think I have ever experienced before it's usually just two colors so that's really exciting that we get three different variants of color elastic here um, and then, like I said, on the inside, it is really soft. There's no pebbling, there's no flaking or pulling away. Um, like I've seen in other um, notebooks, it's super soft and it's just really, really pretty. And you guys know I absolutely love this cover. There is a very clear air mail vibe to this cover. Um, a lot of people were saying that it gave them like a barber uh, wheel toward, sort of thing, like a barbershop thing. But for me, I instantly connected because it looked um, like air mail to me. And the cover, um, it has a texture to it. Um, it's not just like regular paper. There's like a sheen to it, like a shine. And then the actual logo or the image here um, is embossed with a matte black finish. So it's not shiny, but it is embossed with um, maybe like a, like a vinyl ink maybe. 
I don't know. I don't know if you guys can see the shine. I can see it when I do this, but I don't know if it pulls up on camera, but it is beautiful. Um, and it does feel different than the notebooks that I have had in the past. Um, and then of course it has the beautiful cream colored Midori paper inside. It does feel um, like there's a little bit more paper in it, but maybe not. Maybe it's just been a while since I've had one of these. Um, but yeah, the paper is just absolutely divine and I cannot wait to use this. I don't know, maybe I'll hoard it forever. I, I don't know, maybe not because Mitz did send over an extra one. So I don't know, maybe I don't have a choice. I have to use this, but um, I'm very, 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 very excited to have this. I cannot wait to use it. I might even make it um, my daily use notebook. I don't know. I feel like I connect with this one um, a little bit stronger than I did connect with my hotel edition. Um, I just felt a little bit disappointed with the hotel edition that I got because the foiling was just so... Um, I don't know, just so scratched and, and messed up, like out of the box. It was so imperfect that it sort of, I don't know, I, I lost a connection with it. It just felt like it wasn't mine already. And um, this one just feels, it just feels very reminiscent of the Pan Am Blue. Um, and I feel connected to it almost immediately. So I'm really excited to use this. I really do love the Superior Labor um, as a brand, as a company, everything that it stands for and all the things that they produce it's quite expensive um, but the quality is top-notch it can't be beat so I really do appreciate um, the quality that comes with that and um, yeah I'm just really excited to use this <laughs> um, I do think I will leave the light blue elastic on there rather than change it to this dark or red I just feel like it complements this silver or white ink um, here I really wish I could tell if it was silver or white. Um, I don't think it says, but um, yeah, it's just, it's really lovely and I can't wait to use it. So I will link Mitz's unboxing um, where she opened up her camel edition so that you guys can see the differences between the two. But um, as far as I'm concerned, I'm very happy with mine. <laughs> um, I don't know. It just is really, really nice. And it feels just really nice at my hands. It's got that really slick, soft feeling. There's not a lot of um, fight against my fingers. It just feels very much like the Pan Am Blue. So I'm, I'm immediately drawn to it. Um, but I'll bring it in a little bit closer so you guys can see some of the close-ups. And um, yeah, like I said, I'll leave Mitz's video below if you want to see her unboxing. Until next time, friends, thank you so much for hanging out. Bye!